Alrighty, you guys. What's good? It's your boy, Businessman Cam here, back with another video. And the day has come that we buy more vending machines. So as y'all see, I got the backpack on me uh, with the cash in it, everything. Um, you got my notebooks and everything to take inventory. I'm headed to a big warehouse to buy four vending machines in, that is in like one big uh, warehouse location uh, where they do lab lab work and stuff. Um, and the, the location makes pretty good money every month as far as what the guy says. We're about to go meet him. So hopefully everything goes smoothly and um, everything works out because I should have uh, four more uh, machines, two snack, two soda, and it's coming summertime, so I'm trying to pick up as many locations as I can and that I can afford anyways and start getting this money rolling. So let's get in the car. We got to get gas real quick, and then we're going to go head over to this location, and uh, let's go get it. Money time, baby. All right, you guys, so I am here. Um, as you guys can see, I'm wearing a different outfit because it is the next day. So I made the deal with the guy yesterday. I ended up buying the vending machines. There's four machines, two snack, two drink. Um, I ended up doing it and this is the big office building. I don't know how well you can see. Okay, there we go because of the sun. Um, but it's a huge, huge building and they do some software development or something like that here. Um, but I actually, we met up yesterday. We went through everything. We made the deal. Um, I bought a little bit of inventory off of him, so it's pretty much full, so I don't really got to do anything. I came here today to change the prices, but then I realized I forgot my Dymo uh, label printer to change some of the prices, like the drinks, uh, the sodas are at 75 cents, I could easily change that to a dollar for more profit, and I doubt anyone would really have a problem with it. Um, so I, me I meant to change that, but it's okay, because there's still other stuff I can do, because I still need to take inventory. So I brought my lovely mother here with me today to kind of help me uh, just take inventory and stuff. I don't, I don't really need her help, but I kind of want to show her the locations as well, or the location. So I'm just going to take you guys in there. I don't know how much I'll be able to record because I don't want to invade people's privacy, but I, I know I can record the rooms right now are a little bit empty. Right, perfect, no one's in here. All right, you guys, so this is my first machine. Uh, it is a snack machine. As you guys can see, it's like in the little break room of this place. I'm trying not to be too loud because I don't want to interrupt anyone or get in the way. But uh, you guys can see this is a snack machine. That soda machine isn't mine. Um, there's three, or the, there's another part of this place, which is their laboratory, which is right back there. And then this is like the front office building that runs like this whole building. Um, so they put machines here and machines in the back. The other three machines that I actually own are in the back, but I just wanted to quickly show you guys. But yeah, there's definitely more profit to be made here, guys. The prices on this machine are absolutely like so weird. Um, sorry if it gets kind of loud. The machine next to me is kind of being loud, but you see there's 85 cents. Let me focus. 85 cents for chips. That makes no sense. It could easily be a dollar. These are a dollar. A dollar 25 for Kit Kat. Dude, that should either be 75 cents or a dollar. I usually have my candy at all the dollar. These prices just don't make sense to me. So a lot of them could be changed, lowered, even a lot of them could be increased. So yeah, this is the first machine. So we're gonna go ahead and take inventory real quick. And we'll all right, you guys, so this is the main break area where my other three machines are. We're about to take inventory over there, but so this is one of my machines. Um, it's a drink machine as you guys can see dude like literally this is a random drink this is a random this is random this never sells and this never sells so I'm literally gonna put all sodas put some monsters change the price 75 cents for a drink like I could change that easily to a dollar um, you know what I mean but yeah so this is one of them he also like he's really nice he included a Bluetooth pay um, so you just put your phone up here so I may or may not move these Bluetooth things. So this is uh, my other snack machine that's in the break room. Um, I'll show you guys the inside. It's like a lab. They work on like software and stuff development. It's actually really cool. So I'll try to sneak a video on my way out of here. But this is everything that's in this machine. Like I said, older machines, but they work great. Soda machine. Um, you guys can see all the sodas. All 75 cents. It doesn't make sense, does it? So I can easily put those to a dollar and make way more profit. Uh, even though I might sell this machine just because it doesn't make sense to have two drink machines in one, you know what I mean, in one place. 
So I'm thinking of selling this or moving this machine to a, another location once I land another one. Uh, I'm guessing that makes sense too. And this, this one has the Bluetooth reader as well. So um, as you guys can see, there's an out of order on this one because the sensor is like broken on that one. Uh, there was broken on like three, but the dude had them fixed. So now there's just one and I'll probably get that fixed soon and maybe move it and then put most of these types of sodas in this one. Alrighty boys and gals, and just like that we're done. We just took inventory. Um, saw, as you guys saw in my last clip, I, I didn't want to put them in there too much or get their face, but got someone using the vending machine live action. Um, there wasn't much in there because, like money wise, because they haven't, like I said, they haven't had their main lunch yet. And like I said, they have lunch every day. They're open Monday through the back part where I showed you guys right now, the little lab. That's open until seven to three and the front office is open until 5 Monday through Friday um, and we will see how much we make I'll probably do a two-week collection unless they call me back earlier um, can you check it down uh, uh, yeah and then yeah met the main boss guy that kind of runs the show He's a super nice guy literally such a normal guy it's crazy but they do like I said software and stuff um, for like machinery because obviously that has to be something to tell the machines what to do so that's pretty much how she explained it to us and uh, yeah so that's pretty much it for this video if you guys did enjoy please be sure to hit that like button comment subscribe we got another location baby let's go we're just gonna keep trucking and get more locations and we're gonna be making this money all right see you guys in the next video peace